to the 80s, shall we? <laughs> Hello, my friends. Jetrin is here. Summer is sadly over, but it does not have to because in today's video, I'm about to show you guys some awesome product and a new brand that no one has really been talking about. So they go by the name Vacation. Yes, Vacation, like the thing you should be taking because you deserve it. <laughs> I found this brand through Instagram while I was just scrolling one day and I was taken back by the entire feed and photo. Everything was just so nostalgic to the 80s. I just I just had to buy their products. Now before I do dive in into the products that I purchased, I do want to give a brief history of the company because we got to learn a little bit about the backstory. So this brand Vacation was founded and launched earlier this year in June of 2021. So they are a relatively new brand and I was just like, where have they been all my life? The founder name is Marty Bell and he is the creator of the internet radio station called Poolside FM. Now Poolside FM is sort of like an upbeat 80s nostalgic music. Apparently they do have like a cult following so that is how they got pretty popular on the internet radio. Now based on what I've read it seems like Marty wanted to capture the essence of music and turn it into nostalgic products. So of course he collaborated with two entrepreneurs based in Miami named Latch Hall and Dakota Green. These two wanted to create sunscreens as a company so of course they both merged together and created this awesome sunscreen product that I'm about to show you. So introducing their very popular sunscreen, this here is called the Vacation Classic Lotion. They do say this is the world's best smelling sunscreen in the world. So you know, that lives up to the hype, I guess. And can we take a minute and look at this bottle? Because everything from the font and color, it just seems like if I was to transport back to the 80s, I can definitely see this on the shelf. They really did pay attention to details. This classic lotion retails for $20 USD and you are getting 3.4 fluid ounce or 100 ml. This sunscreen claims to be SPF 30. It is a chemical sunscreen. It's 80 minute water resistance. It is octinizate and oxybenzone free, reef friendly formula, paraben and PAG free, it's vegan and cruelty free. The ingredients in this sunscreen does include coconut oil, aloe vera, banana extract, niacinamide and vitamin E. I am going to put the remainder sunscreen ingredients here because I'm not going to try to pronounce it. It's just, it's too much for me. <laughs> but yeah, you guys, this, oh my goodness, it smells just like what it claims i do smell the coconut the banana kind of almost like like a pina colada just a bit it just makes me want to go back to the 80s you know even though i was never born in that decade it really does have that nostalgic scent to it so i really love this when it comes to the texture of the sunscreen it comes out like a lotion um, as you can see and when you do rub it in it just sinks in you do not feel a thing and that is what i love when it comes to a sunscreen if you guys don't know i don't like anything sticky or tacky or greasy feeling so this sunscreen did not disappoint. Everything from the scent to the packaging to the sunscreen texture itself, I freaking love. I can definitely see myself repurchasing. Actually, I am going to repurchase this because I love it that much. So I highly recommend you picking this up for sure. Next item I have here is another sunscreen. Yes, they didn't just come out with one, but they came out with two. And here is the Vacation Mineral Lotion Sunscreen. This does retail for $22 USD and you are getting the same amount, 3.4 fluid ounce or 100 ml. Now this sunscreen claims to be also SPF 30. It is also 80 minute water resistance. It is fragrance free. So this has no sense at all. If you are sensitive to scents or you don't like scents, this is probably a better purchase. This also claims to be reef friendly. It does have non nano zinc formula into this. So that does mean this is a physical sunscreen and not a chemical. It's PEG and paraben free, also vegan and cruelty free. The ingredients listed in this sunscreen does have zinc oxide, allotonic, shea butter, cucumber extract, and niacinamide. So it is very hydrating. Going back to the scent, let's take a sniff. Yeah, 
it smells like nothing. I don't smell anything at all. I guess I can kind of smell just like the base of the sunscreen. Now when it comes to the texture, this is where it kind of goes downhill and I have to be completely honest with you guys. I don't like the texture of the sunscreen. Um, as you can see in the demo, it comes out thick. Like she's thick, okay? You definitely need to use some elbow grease to kind of rub it in into your skin for it to sink in. So it does take a couple minutes before you know, it just settles uh, compared to the classic lotion. So this sunscreen does leave a dewy sort of sheen to it unlike the classic lotion. But not only that, it just feels like the classic like sunscreen where the texture just feels very icky and sticky I, i'm not about that life when i was taking a shower or wash my body i noticed it doesn't really completely come off so you really have to go in with like a loofah or some sort of like body scrub or an exfoliant to kind of get rid of the sunscreen but overall it's not a bad product i just think personal preference it's not my personal taste i would only recommend this sunscreen if you have dry dehydrated sensitive or you get really ashy at the beach you probably will like this better because it is more hydrating and more moisturizing but if you have oily skin like i do i would skip this out i just don't think this is it uh, i would prefer the classic lotion over this for sure yeah before i forget this sunscreen does leave a slight white cast to your skin because again it is a zinc based sunscreen it's not like the worst thing in the world i have seen other sunscreen that it really makes you look very ghostly. Just as a precautious, I wanted to tell you guys, it can leave a slight white cast if you have medium to darker skin tone. So just letting you guys know. Next item I have here is called the Vacation Super Spritz. Now, funny enough, this item I did not want to purchase. I did get this item because I did buy this bundle pack, which come with the classic lotion, the super spritzer, and like two car air freshener, which I'm about to show you. And by the way, look how it came in. It came in with like this classic pharmacy paper bag. Genius! I'm telling you guys, they really did pay attention to details when it comes to packaging. Anyways, going back to the spritzer, this is a hydrating face it does retail for $12 USD and you're only getting one fluid ounce and right off the bat I do think this is very expensive for one fluid ounce girl you are going to go through this so fast I, I just don't think it's worth it for the price. The ingredients does include coconut water, cucumber extract, aloe vera, chamomile, vanilla extract, niacinamide, and hyaluronic acid. So again, it is very hydrating while soothing your skin. It is free from PEG, alcohol, silicone. It's vegan and cruelty-free. Now, let's see how this spritz. Oh, yes. Mmm. Give it to me. <laughs> So the nozzle does spray really nicely and fine, which I love. And I do smell the coconutty, aloe vera, the vanilla extract just a little bit. So it is very refreshing and cooling. Perfect when you are at the beach and you want to help cool yourself down. This is definitely a must. Now, obviously, do you need to buy this product? I don't think so. I do think you can definitely skip out on this product. I mean, it is a very fun and novelty item to have, but it's not something you definitely need. Again, my only complaint is it is pretty pricey for how much you're getting. So if they are watching my videos, uh, I hope maybe in the future they will make a bigger bottle because I do think a lot of people will appreciate more for the price they are paying. Last item that came in the bundle kit are some air fresheners. I know, look how cute this is. <laughs> it is shaped as the classic lotion. It is in the scent, so it is the world famous vacation sunscreen scent. This does retail for five bucks. And yeah, they decided to make some air freshener so you can put this in your car, your home, your office. Again, do you need this item? Probably not, but it is definitely a fun novelty to have. It's definitely a great conversational starter for sure because people are gonna be like, what is that? I should definitely put this in my car so it would smell like summer all year round. Oh yeah, let me not forget, along with the bundle kit, it did come with this like little lottery scratcher. I mean, <laughs> I'm dying over this. How freaking cute is this? I mean, they did not have to do this. They didn't have to include this, but I just think, you know, them sticking along with the theme, it is very nostalgic when you do think of like, I guess, 80s lottery scratcher. I don't know. I mean, I'm probably going to hang this on my wall or something. It's too cute. Too cute. 
Now, before I do show you guys the last item I purchased, I do want to quickly mention one item that I did not buy. And this here is the Chardonnay oil, or it is their like sun tanning oil. It does retail for $22 and you are getting 3.4 fluid ounce. So it is the same amount you are getting as the sunscreen. Now this does have great seep oil. Um, so it is very nourishing and hydrating, but it is also protecting your skin because of the SPF 30. So if you do want to look like a rotisserie chicken, a delicious one I do think this is a great buy for sure uh, personally for me I just knew I wasn't going to use it because again I'm oily as is and I don't need more oils on my body so that is why I didn't buy it last but not least this item here comes on no surprise why I had to buy it because of the packaging just look at it introducing this is the vacation by vacation perfume scent can you guys see it I mean it's a, it's a little blinding right they did take the classic lotion scent and turn it into a perfume it is LD toilet it does retail for $60 USD and you are getting one fluid ounce I do think that is pretty reasonable since it is a perfume so you're not really using it that much uh, a little bit does go a long way but yeah going back to the packaging just look at this you guys isn't this gorgeous it definitely looks like something from the 80s and i i just love the bottle it really does feel very expensive for sure um so yeah i'm going to put this on my vanity or even on my bookshelf to display this perfume is great for all genders it was developed by a Aquist perfumer i think that's how you pronounce it and also it was developed from rodrigo flores rue who is a very famous scent maker he did make like tom ford and even clinique scent so you guys know they really got the hookups when it comes to perfume perfecting the perfect scent. Now for the fragrance notes, this does have petagrain essence, which is kind of like oranges, coconut water and milk, bergamot, solo musk, banana, pineapple, pool water, swimsuit lycra, which is like spandex and sea salt. It's very pool-like pool scent for sure. Now let's take a quick sniff of this perfume, which by the way, the cap is made from a nice plastic and the bottle is made from glass. So right away, when you first sniff this perfume, you do have that similar scent to the classic lotion of course but when you do sniff it just a little bit more it does get a little bit deeper and sharper you do smell that like musk um, and the bergamot overall they really did create the scent to be very very nostalgic pool like 80 vibe <laughs> but yeah if i can kind of vision the scent i feel like if i had like an auntie you know she was in her prime times in the 80s uh she would be that auntie that would go to the clubs and try to pick up all the guys she would wear this i can i can see her wearing this that's just what i envision if you are interested in buying this perfume but you don't want to commit to the whole bottle because it is 60 dollars, they do have a 1.5 milliliter sample size for you to buy uh, and it does cost five bucks so a great way to try this perfume without really committing to the entire bottle now before i end this video i have to show you guys the box that the perfume came in you guys it looks like a pr box tell me it doesn't look like a pr box and it has like a little insert of a magnetic of a random two couples <laughs> again they didn't have to do that and also can we talk about the receipt look at the paper it comes in like the classic fax machine paper with the holes <laughs> literally they went above and beyond i'm i'm really mind blown with the entire packaging <laughs> it's like nostalgic but funny i just i can't <laughs> all right guys so there we have it that concludes my entire review for vacation and if you can't tell i freaking love this brand i just think they are so genius with the whole packaging, the products, the marketing, even the scent, it is definitely nostalgic for sure. A lot of the times when a brand or a company comes out with an 80s, 90s, or early 2000 theme, it's like very half-assed, you know, but vacation literally went above and beyond they outdid themselves i just feel like everything that they included it's like an experience of itself and i think that is just what consumer wants in today's purchase now out of everything from this video the only thing i would really recommend for you to try is the classic lotion again from the texture to the scent it's definitely going to give you that nostalgic feeling and i do think you are going to like this for sure now besides their products they do sell like apparel items or like accessories so they sell like visors, hat, t-shirt, towels. I've seen they sell like a gondola or some sort. <laughs> now, if you do want to purchase anything from this brand, please make sure you do use the link down below. It is my referral link. So if three people do buy it, I do get a nice bottle of the classic lotion and 
Come on, come on. I'm doing this review for you guys. At least you can use my link, okay? Um, I'm not getting paid though, so just FYI. If you do not want to buy anything from Vacation, definitely check out their Instagram and website for sure. You guys, the graphic design out of this world. Just everything from the font, the colors, the picture. It literally feels like you've been transported back to the 80s. I kid you not. So please go check them out for sure. So with that being said, if you are new here, please consider subscribing to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up because it will help me in the long run. And of course, I will talk to you guys soon in the next one because I'm about to take a vacation myself, you know? Okay. <laughs> Have a great one. Bye.